can certainly say that um, The Hobbit is a lovely introduction to that masterpiece sequel. And uh, you should start with, um, with uh, the first one before reading the second one. Uh, this um, enchanting tale was made up by, uh, by talking to, uh, for the children, for, for his uh, children. And um, once it was published, it achieved an almost success. The story um, tells the adventures of a hobbit called Bilbo Baggins. Um, Bilbo and a group of dwarves were, um, were called to an unexpected party at uh, Bilbo's by the wise wizard Gandalf. And um, Bilbo live, lives in, in a hole uh, on the ground and as any other hobbit uh, he likes um, peas and food and quiet and smoke uh, on the pipe and he doesn't, uh, he, he, he dislikes uh, adventures and uh, um, he has never gone beyond the Brandivino River. But things change um, for Bilbo after the meeting because uh, he sets off on an amazing journey with the with 14 dogs and Gandalf's help um, they, 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 go, they, they have to, to go to the uh, distant uh, mountain called the Lonely Mountain to recover a treasure uh, stolen by uh, the terrifying dragon smile to the uh, to the doors, and uh, uh, on on the journey they they run dangerous adventures, uh, such as being captured by by goblins under the misty mountains, and in this place Bilbo meets um, the very famous. A nasty and hissing creature called Gollum, and is where he finds uh, the famous ring that makes him disappear uh, when he sleeps it on hi in in his finger. And um, they were also caught by by trolls. Trolls are um, strange uh, in creatures that must be underground before down, otherwise they go back to the staff of the mountain they, they, they are made of and never move again. But on the other hand, in this journey they also meet um, extraordinary characters like uh, the elves of, uh, from Rivendell and um, uh, Beorn, uh, also called Karok. Uh, he is um, strong and he is a skin changer. Sometimes he is a huge black bear and sometimes he is um, a strong, uh, strong black haired man. Um, he lives in uh, oak wood and keeps cattle, horses and, um, and bees. Bees, um, a fierce bees, um, great fierce bees, uh, but he, he never hunts and he never eats animals. He is the person who warns um, the, the hobbit and the dwarves against the perils of Weirwood, where they, um, they run many more dangerous and weird adventures. This, um, this book is um, quite shorter than uh, The Lord of the Rings, uh, highly entertaining and easy to read. Um, at the same time, it uh, displays all Tolkien's talent with a fluent narrative technique. 
uh, that takes the, mm, the reader's mind to the world of fantasy, the Arthur, uh, the Arthur um, describes. So, uh, if you are a lover of, uh, mm, of fantasy and adventure, if you like uh, this kind of books, this is a must read and uh, of course it's a, a great delight. Mm.